Hello guys and girls and welcome back to the next episode of Cities Skylines with me, Biffa. Thank you very much for joining me. Here we are at the bottom of the sort of rivery thing that comes down from the mountains where our dam is at the top. And little do these people know what's coming. Well, maybe they do. Look, it's sort of lapping up on the beach. A tiny spot because, yeah, yeah. thank you for driving down the road where there's nothing down there. Look, yeah, we, we sort of overflowed our water um, a bit. This seems to be heading down here. But, yeah, by the end of last episode, I couldn't work out why this wasn't up to a 1,000. Aha! The budget, of course. If we stick that up to 150%, I forgot it was probably on 100 100%. Oh my goodness me, we're having a bit of a death wave. What's going on over here? We're having some death. Um, let's just check our healthcare available. Average health 68%. It's going up. It was the death care that was the problem. That's what it was. Yeah, there we go. Availability going up. They'll sort themselves out. So let's have a look at this again. And I bet we've got 1,200. Let's have a look. What? <laughs> Whoa, it's still going up. Let's speed the game up and see what it gets up to. 1,680. We've got 1,700 there uh, for a moment. Whoa, that is nice. That is absolutely nuts. That is more power. 1,712. One, so that now does 1,712. What we could do, because we're probably spending a lot of money. Yeah, look, we're not actually making... Oh, how much does that cost us then? Geologists predict that a sinkhole... Whoa, a sinkhole. Uh, it's outside the area. We're fine. So what's that costing us? 4,800. Blinking it. Okay, well, let's put that down. There's the sinkhole. Let's put that down to 100. A sinkhole has occurred somewhere there we go. It's underwater. I don't need to worry about the sinkhole. Whoa, man. Got some fires raging over there. Our population's dropped to 29,000. Uh, 3,200 a week, still 1,000 odd. Our power is... Okay, so we, we, we're getting the power. We've got lots of power. Let's turn that down, and I think we'll be fine. We want to just save some money. Uh, City did not suffer any damage. Congratulations. So that's good. Um, hopefully all these... Uh, woo, flipping heck. Wow. Wow. That is pretty rough. Um... Why is that so bad? Other than... I th it must just be my cemetery was full. Which is now being emptied. Which is along here somewhere. I've completely lost where it is. Where's the cemetery? There it is. There. Is that still emptying? Yes. Building is emptying. Hearse is in use. Okay. Well, we'll leave that like that. I put a few smaller hearses around. Hopefully that will help. But we need to get some more people in. Uh, we need to expand. So I'm thinking maybe um, that we're going to expand to down here. I like the look of this area here. Bottom of the mountain. And then maybe we can put some monorails and that sort of stuff in here as well. Uh, we've got this connection off of the highway, but I'm thinking we'll give these guys... Oh, they have their own connection down here. Uh, that was my little rubbishy connection I put together. No, let's put a decent connection in the middle here. Uh, the diverging diamond interchange. Now, I saw some comments about that. Where is it? It was getting a bit backed up, and I think the reason is, is there's actually no traffic lights on it. Yeah, these are getting backed up. Everybody's getting backed up. Oh, my goodness me. So, there should be traffic lights on this thing, but there isn't. There's, like, give way signs everywhere. So, I'm wondering whether that would help fix it. But at the moment, it's just this here. These are sort of stuck. They're stuck. It's all stuck on here, isn't it? Hmm... They're stuck coming off of here. I think we need to give more access to motorways. Yeah. Do you know what? I'm going to sort of slightly ignore that for now because I want to do this and then we can look into getting more public transport and stuff like that in to sort out maybe some issues like that. Could we fit a nice big, slightly different style? The i10 US61 interchange version 1.1. Just something like that. It's got that curve to it. So we could sort of fit it in here. And it curves that way. I think that's what we're going to go with. Sorry, cars that are on your journey. 
and press the one key twice in a row there. Let's delete all of this. Give ourselves some room. Let's delete that as well. Uh, there we go. We do it like that. Always leave one road a little bit longer so you can sort of hook onto it without anybody complaining. So that's going to be the curve there. Let's delete that one. Hmm. Going to let me hook onto the end? Yes, like that. And then I want to get that on and get the other end lined up. With this road over there. I mean, that's not too bad, actually. In fact, I'm just going to go with that. Because then we can change this little bit here. Yeah, that's good. Let's go with that. Let us grab our highways. Thank you very much. Uh, yep, three-lane highway. I'm going to delete that. I'm going to connect like that. There we go. I thought that was the curve tool, and it wasn't, but that's fine. Let's take those bits out. Let's try and get this to curve around and connect nicely. Uh, have we got the road things on? I'm pressing the button. Let's do it again. Yeah, there we go. This one is the one I want to connect to. All right, well, I'm just going to do it by eye. If <laughs> you're going to be funny and not give me the, the, the symbol that I need. Excellent. There we go. How about that for a highway junction? That looks good to me. And got some fences there. Did I... Are Prop and Tree Anarchy off? Fine road anarchy is off. So I think they're just fences that come with come with this. Yes, they are. Uh, or are they? Are they ones that are actually on here already? I don't know. But we'll we'll look through. We'll remove some of those. In fact, I'll tell you what we're going to do is we're going to grab that. Mm -hmm. In fact, we're just going to delete that. We don't need it. There we go. It's gone. Um, that one. Hang on a sec. If we grab both of those, there we go. Just sort of turn them around a bit and they can be pointless over there on their own. Good. So that gives us access into these two sides. And then at either end of these, we are definitely going to put a roundabout because that's just going to make things so much easier. And we're going to go for one of these. Let's have a look. So let's get that in the middle there. Perfect. Let's run this road through here. So if we do any changes to the roundabout, it doesn't mess it up. And then we're going to do the same the other side, which is going to disconnect our power. I'm not overly concerned about that because we have a huge amount of power. But obviously, we need to connect it back up again. They're complaining. Bing. There we go. Okay, and then we're going to upgrade this. Let's grab our motorway two-lane highway. Let's go for that one. Oh, it always blooming does the ones you don't want. So that's going all around like that. That's fine. Uh, this is going to get deleted anyway, so that's not a problem. Uh, let's upgrade this one. Whoa! That's not upgrading. Oh, darn it. Can I connect that up? Yes, there we go. Excellent. I had the wrong button on. There we go. Very good. So that's going around. Oh, anti-clockwise. Is that the way our roundabouts are going now? I know it changed. Oh, autosave, save sympathy. I know it's the opposite way to whatever this one's going. Which is both ways. <laughs> Helpful. Yeah, there we go. Anti-clockwise. So we're going anti-clockwise. That's fine. Um, so let's connect these up. And do you know what? I've made these two lanes. These are three lanes. I should have actually left them as three lane highways, which they now are. That's good. So then we're going to grab these. And that one's going to go to there. And that one's going to go to there. There we go. And we'll do the same over here. That one will go to there. And that one will go to there. Excellent. I'm going to just make sure these are facing the right way. Perfect. There we go. Make sure that one's facing the right way. Perfect as well. Good. So that is our connections. I can remove these ones in the middle because if we need to change those, we'll just upgrade them. There we go. Good. There we go. So we now have access to that part of the city. People are loving this, loving this new interchange, which is just what we want to see. So how should we do this then? Let's have a look at the value of the land. So it's all pretty low at the moment 
But if we take this bit here, let's just concentrate on a small section like just here and see what we can do with that. So that road's going to get changed. What is that? Three lanes either way. That's going to be miles too big for what we're going to do in here. So what's that one? Six lane. This one here. Yeah, let's take that one. So that is going to come straight through here. Yeah, please let me connect to that. Thank you very much. And then let's just see what we can do with that. So we've got two lanes going each way. If we take this one, can we do a one-way version? Yeah, let's take that one. And if we go round and back, can I get underneath there? Probably not. I bet I can upgrade some of these. And this is going to be a nice, posh area to live. I'm going to go with this one. So we're going to go... Let's take off that. We're going to go like that. So we're going to try and have lots of space for houses along here. Either side of this road. Yeah, we'll go around there. Hmm. Maybe we can go up and over here. So let's make that straight. And page up. Straight over. Yep, page down. Let's make that as short as possible. There we go. Yep. Meteorologists Whoa. are issuing a thunderstorm okay, that's fine. for the coming days. Citizens are advised to stay So indoors. we'll sort of go there, go around there. I think I mentioned last episode, I thought that the voice, the announcement voice was getting a bit loud. I've actually got it turned right down. I think it's just loud in my headphones. I don't think it's too loud for you guys. So I'm basically going back over there again. So I'll tell you what, let's go straight here. We'll go there, then we'll go page up. Then we'll go over. Then we'll go page down. Let's see, how close are we getting to that? Let's make that a little bit shorter. So if we take that again and go page down as short as we can. Which is going to be there. Yep, there we go. And then we'll try and get this. Sort of go like that. A little wiggle in. So that's one way round. So people coming up this road can go straight on there. And when they're coming back, they can go straight in there. That's not... Oh man, the deaths. We're at 28,000. We're growing again. So that's good. Let us get some water pipes around here. There we go, water pipes are in, and then we've got this little section here. I'm just wondering whether we could have this as like a, a shop area. So if we take just some two-way roads like that, we could have this as a junction. So that could come straight up there, that could come straight up there. Yep, there we go. And then maybe... A little something here, or a little something there. Can that go all the way to the end? Whoops. Let's do that as close as it'll go. And that one as close as it'll go. Whoa! Massive road coming up. <laughs> Not what we wanted. There we go. We get a nice little... I think we can get a little bit more over here as well. If we can do that. Yeah, there we go. Doesn't have to be the same on both sides. How's the storm going? Whoa, look at that. Loppy neck. And then we could have in here, hmm, what could we put in here? We want, this is going to be a nice area, but I'm thinking we could put, we've got the posh mall, which is pretty massive. Yeah, that's not going to fit in there. Something that people can come and visit that's not huge, the courthouse. Courthouse by the river, we could get that to work. That would be great. But I don't think it's going to fit in right by the side of the river. It could fit in by the ends like that. I mean, that's, that's got a noise buffer around it, but it's also got a bonus of happiness sort of around it as well. I think that'll be cool to put that there. And then this section here could be sort of like some small shops like this. Yeah, around there like that. Maybe get up to in front of there as well. That looks good. Yep, we've got some needs for those. And then these, I'm going to make this like a high-tech one again. So if we grab all of this right up to there. Because I like the high-tech area around the, other, around the other lake. It sort of sorted itself out in the end and became high-tech. Right, so we need a name for this area. I'm going to randomly pick one from all the lovely people that support me on Patreon. Link in the description below if you wish to do that. 
One second. Okay, the popular district is now going to be Eat Cereal District. Thank you very much for your support on Patreon. It means a lot. So let's have a look at here. So we've got the lightning rods, which the whole city has got. Uh, we want high-tech housing. Small business enthusiasts. Go on, let's have that. Uh, encourage biking. Old town. Only residents and businesses can use the area for motor vehicles. Or, yeah, let's go for that. Uh, let's also go for combustion engine ban and use electric cars. We're going to make this really posh in this area here. So let's do that. Um, what else do we need in here? Let us get maybe a park or two sort of in here. We've got something a bit different that we could put in here. Tropical garden. Oh, that's quite nice. Oh, how about something up against the water here? Um, wherever the... What is going on with the... Oh, water pipes. Yeah, begging your pardon. Begging your pardon. Let's get some of those in. There we go. Probably need them over here as well. There we go. Hope that's okay. Um, yeah, let's get something up against the water. One of these. I mean, it's a tiny little fishing pier seems a bit much. Fishing tour. Not much to tour, really. Jet ski rentals. And that could be quite good. Has that got a noise? No, it hasn't. You could do jet skis. We really need to raise that up, don't we? I don't think they can get jet skis under there. How about a restaurant? Let's have a look. Marina. Restaurant pier. There we go. I think that'll be good. And then we can run this road up here to down there, can't we? Let us bring that. Uh, can we let come out a bit further with that? Oh, auto save. I need to lessen the auto save now. Now we're not crashing all the time. There we go. Power, of course. Yes, you're going to complain about that, aren't you? Let us grab this one here. That's going to go right into that. And I'm sure that's going to give you all the power you need. And you're going to need a water pipe as well. Uh, let's turn those on. There we go. And if we bring you to there. Excellent. So that's definitely going to give a bonus there. And then we're going to just put nice big houses. I think I might have this as commercial as well. We'll have nice big houses around the rest of this and see how that goes. So, seems to have some water flooding down there. <laughs> I don't know where that's come from. Let's put these smack up against the uh, beach. Oh, we're going to have another sort of parky thing this side, weren't we? Beach volleyball. Yeah, a bit much. Riding stables. Riding stables. That could be nice. That won't fit in there. That gives a real good bonus. Uh, maybe that's something that could be done. Hmm. I'm feeling like a little tree-lined area over here with the riding stables in. Let's take that out. Let us grab this. So that can go from there to there. Our riding stables could then sort of fit over here. Like that. That will give a nice bonus to this side. Looks nice with the grass. And then we can sort of do some work on making that look a lot nicer as well. Oh, I'm making all this into commercial by mistake. Begging your pardon. Let's take all of that out. Sorry, folks. Glad nobody's moved in. There we go. We're making this into housing. So let's add all of this in along here. I'm not sure how far down we'll go there, but we'll do those ones. Uh, these ones on the inside here as well. Let's grab those. Excellent. Excellent. So we'll do that, and then we'll let those move in. Let's just speed the game up a bit. So we have some needs down here. Oh, you need power. Let's have a look. I'm sure we can grab some from somewhere. For now, you need water. Let's grab some from over here. Yeah, there we go. That'll do that. Uh, you've still got water flooding over here. And quite what's going on there, look. Like, it's slightly a bit weird. It's like a little homemade dam or something. Wonder whether we can fix that. Let's just see if we can level this off. So brush strength, brush size. If we say right click there and then make this a bit taller. Will that stop the water going through? Yes, there we go. Excellent. And everybody's happy. Oh, they're all moving in. Uh, you're going to complain about not enough workers. Well, we've got workers around here. With some lovely houses going up. 
Not upgraded yet, so they're not the high-tech ones that we will see. But they will become... Oh, look at those apartments. What is going on in the water over here as well? Look. That is just no good, people. That is just no good. Okay, let's take... That is a high bit there and build that up. Whoa! <laughs> Sorry, people. <laughs> okay, let's change this. Let's go uh, up, up, and then we'll get that height and bring that across there. Yeah? Is that going to be okay? And then we need to do the same just here, do we? No, it's rolling back. No, we're fine. Everybody else fine. No other places you fancy sort of linking... Nope. We look okay. Excellent. That's what we want. We want people moving in. Still getting the French houses in here, the European things. But there's not a huge amount I can do about that, it seems. I can't find them in the game to get rid of them. I don't know why. I don't know why. There we go. That's just the answer. So, we're going to live with it. Every now and again, getting some of those popping in. They look interesting and nice. We'll just go with it. Uh, this side they've not moved into yet. That's Okay. Hopefully, they will start to work some of these jobs. You know what we're going to do? I was saying not enough workers. Yeah, well, I'm just going to put in here. Every time I do this, I'll get 20 different comments about it. Uh, school's out. People say they'll take the jobs anyway. Well, they probably will, but this will help them take the jobs. Uh, school. Oh, that's city policies. Nope. Eat cereal. There we go. Hmm. School's out. Did I put it on the city by mistake? City policies, no. I've got parks and recreation boosted everywhere. And in here as well. Excellent, that's good. All services, they've got absolutely no services over here, have they? Of course, we need to put some down here. Let us make a, an area for the services. So, oh, they're parking. I said, what are they doing down there? Let's maybe bring that down here. Connect that into there. Yeah, why not? Doesn't have to be straight. Let's use our imagination. So trash collection is going to be nowhere near down here. So that is going to be right... We're going to put that over there until we need to move it. But that will do for now. We'll get a nice little clinic down here, which should boost everything. And I'm going to put that here. So it's right in the middle. And we'll get the... Uh, crematorium next to it. I was going to say crematorium and second guess myself. We'll have, let's see, let's put that one up here somewhere. Over here, we'll cover the whole road. More or less. Let's put that there and then police over this side. We'll sort of spread things around a bit. I can do it. It's about taking out too many buildings. There we go. Uh, we also have, I mean, we've got police helicopter, which we haven't done yet. We'll look at some of those another time, but for now, I and mean, then we didn't put any in here at all, did we? And now they're cutting through with that road. Mm, nope, maybe not. <laughs> You're using this road, which is what I wanted people to use. Oh, man, we've still got a death wave going on. 27,000. You know what I'm going to do? All right, we've got... Wow, we're hardly making any money now. We were making so much money before. I don't think we need that up so high. I don't think we need this up so high. Let's just drop that down and see. We've gone from making absolutely tons of money to hardly making any. There we go. It's going up again. Good. Are these all okay? That probably needs to go up to about 70, I reckon. 70. There we go. 70. There we go. Let's do that. Uh, this is up quite high. I don't think we necessarily need to do that. And we've started to make more money. Excellent. Let's look at this again. So, all we're making no money, we remove that. Forestry, we haven't got much. Farming, oil, yeah. 17,000. So, that's dropped. Now, we're making some of our items into goods rather than into um, things we can just straight sell. Then, we're making less money because we're using them ourselves. But that's fine. So that's not bad for a small little area there. We do need to do some work on it. Let us grab our trees. And, yep, we're doing it over the top of an ore industry. What trees are we going to get here? I want that like that. Yeah, I want this to be... More tree-fied under here. 
This whole area down there and down there as well. Let's have a look. In fact, this is going to end up being a connection to industry. Oh, look, you're doing it again. Where, where's it gone? You're deciding to overlap. Oh, you've stopped. Here it is. Look. Stop flooding people's houses. This is just plain rude, I have to say. Uh, let's build this up again. No, nope, wrong way. Oh, strength grief. Let's change that. There we go. And then we'll do that one. And we'll just build this all up along the back. I hope that's okay. Changing the landscape shape. Here we go. It's letting them have their trees back. Nice. Yeah, is that okay? Everybody happy? Yes, everybody's happy. Uh, I want a connection along here. Meteorologists are issuing oh, a not another one. Warning for the coming not days. another one. Citizens are advised Please stop. Uh, let's take this one. There we go. So when we have some industry, we also could have a train connection down here as well, couldn't we, for our passengers? Uh, where does this line go? That line goes under there and comes out over here. Which goes along there. Yeah, which connects to that train station there. Let's have another train connection here. There we go. I think that will be good. What have we got? What have we got? Let's pick something different. Uh, we've got the city station. Which has like a little road that will connect to that. And the rail can come in and out. Is that like a... What is that? Is that like a metro thing? Hello, what's that? Oh, another thunderstorm. <laughs> Thanks. I don't care, it's miles away. Mm, Joak 2 track, Joak 4 track. What's this one here? Oh, this is a nice one. Let's have this one. Oh, no, that's in one in, one out. No, I don't want that one. That's a nice one. Yeah, let's go with this one. We'll have that up against there. Let's say here. Yeah, and then we'll connect that up by doing this. We'll go from there to there. That's now become a weird junction, but that's fine. How about we do the same this side? There we go. So now we can have it in and out over there. Uh, water pipes. Yep. Power. Nope. Let's put some offices along here. There we go. Hopefully they'll start sharing the power. And now we can run a train from here. Create new line from there. Will you keep the thunder down, for goodness sake? All the way over to there. And back again. Yay, our first train line. So this is Eats Cereal to Mr. Rusty. Eats Cereal to Mr. Rusty. So we'll name that one. Eats... Eat cereal to Mr. Rusty. There we go. Excellent. Two stops, two vehicles. Excellent. Let's make it green. Uh, let's give it some power then, I guess, if... Um, let's just give it one... Of, actually, we can just run some power there until the building's moving. Let's just do that. Um, let's hook it up this one here. There we go. When, when the buildings move in, we'll change it. So, these are going because probably not enough customers. Yeah, not enough workers. Well, people are moving in. So, you know, I don't know what you're complaining about. We could probably get some more people to move in if we just put some more houses down here. Like that. We'll leave those offices there. But we've got spaces. And along here. Let's add those. And along here. Yeah, that will do. We might spread this out, have some roads up and down there. Oh, there we go. An office is moving in. Excellent. So how's our train doing? People serviced zero. Well, that's always good. So let us, let's follow this along. There we go. Let's see where this goes. Down here and see what it all looks like. So hit the big B with a T stain to subscribe. Don't miss out on the next episode of City Skyline. Thank you for watching. Check out some of the other videos on screen as well because we've got all sorts of city building games coming up at the moment. Foundation and Cliff Empire are great, great fun. So maybe check them out if you haven't. And I will see you tomorrow for the next episode of City Skyline. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye bye. We're going to go back now as well, aren't we? Yay. See you tomorrow. Bye.